Hey, my middle schoolers, how are you? Back later on a little bit from this morning. And I wanted to show you my art studio. Um, I would like to just add another activity that I was hoping you all would join in. And that is looking up other artist art studios. Remember we talk about keeping everything really neat and tidy and how an artist is actually way more productive when organized, just like an accountant or any other job. And uh, right now I've got a lot of stuff out, but the project at hand right now is my daughter and I are working on making jewelry. And you can see she made these little record earrings <laughs> and some little cat earrings. Um, and all she did was she took a hot um, needle and got it hot, but you have to make sure you do that only under some sort of adult supervision, but um, like a sewing needle. And she just poked it into that plastic right there, that little cat, can you see that little guy? And um, poked it into its head. And then she put um, some glue and put the earring and put a dollop of super glue and attached the hinge right here. So anyway, maybe we'll do that one time when we are having an after school activity. But so I wanted to just kind of show you around my studio. It's very small. It's just an example of you really don't need a huge space to create art. And um, I did it professionally for a really long time. And uh, when I started out, I just started in a tiny, tiny little room. So um, this is one of my pieces that I'm working on. And we're just working with like um, action art like we worked on earlier in the year. And here is my outside patio. And um, sometime I'm gonna show you my horses, but here is my wooden bear. And that was from my dad's house when I was a little girl. Um, here is Mr. Einstein. Always good to have little inspirational things that make you um, make sure that you keep your head in the right space. Get smart, make art. Imagination is more important than knowledge. Hmm. And um, then I just have other little things around. My Nana's lamp that means a lot to me, which is ugly, but I adore it. More inspirational things. Um, I love the view. And then I have tons and tons of paint and it's all organized by color. And then lots of my canvases and things like that. Lots of paint brushes. Everything is organized in um, individual containers, things like that. Those are all special pencils. So anyway, and then there is my um, desk. So uh, I'm getting ready to make um, a vision board and we'll talk more about that later, but I just wanted to show you my studio and I would encourage you to um, show me yours. Um, even if it's a little studio space, a corner of your room. And if you um, would like, I'd love to see if you would look up some other artist studios, um, snap a screenshot and send it to me um, and let me know what you like about them. Okay, I'll talk to you soon. I love this way of talking and I'm really excited about being able to see you via this way. Okay, love Mrs. Blankenship.